tomorrow in may say that is greetings to you all in my own language our honorable guest speaker uh, mr peter nyete from kenya members of uh, the alliance from 32 uh, different african countries president of the alliance mr taurai kajiti from zimbabwe secretary general of the alliance Ms. Shandeo Kachikam Tembo from Rwanda, members of the planning committee chaired by Samuel Chigamba from Malawi, our speakers for the eighth webinar happening uh, today, our able moderator, Professor Najib Kisan from Morocco, ladies and uh, gentlemen, thank you all for joining us in celebrating the first anniversary of the APLEPS Alliance Africa, EAA. The Alliance was founded on 12 December 2019, but uh, the idea was generated way back in 2005 in South Africa in a meeting that uh, included the late uh, Andon Zimba of Zambia and uh, the late Augustine uh, Mugarura of Uganda and myself. May their dear souls rest in peace. The EAA is an alliance of organizations, groups, and individuals that are on the forefront of improving the lives of persons with epilepsy on the African continent. It is the only association of its kind in Africa. If there is one lesson to share with you from the 12 months we've been in operation, it is that Africa and Africans can do it. Let us not undervalue or doubt ourselves. Let us not undermine our capacity to innovate and lead. United who make our communities better for all, including people with epilepsy. Our motto says united against seizures and stigma. And indeed, as an alliance, we successfully achieved this in our first 12 months of operating. The Alliance, of course, is still growing, but already it has members in 32 countries, 32 African countries. It has got 24 registered associations and over 56 individual members who are very active in the Alliance. In our first year of operation, we have reached to thousands of uh, people living with epilepsy through our telehealth and teleeducation programs. The most important being the webinars we do monthly for advocates, for people with epilepsy and for professionals, but also the free teleclinic that we do every Wednesday. I wish uh, to thank uh, Professor Najib Kisan from Morocco for running our free tele uh, clinic. We also promote research and as an alliance, we co-partner the African and Middle East Epilepsy Journal, AMIG. We have also created working partnerships and relationships with a number of organizations in and outside Africa. And this is something that we are very proud of. Chief among us, these organizations is the African Union. Let us not copy what is happening in other countries or internationally without critically thinking about it. This is the second lesson that I've learned in our 12 months of existence as an alliance. If a donor supports you, let it be for your own ideas. The ideas should be yours and they should be relevant to your community. That way you succeed with pride. To mark our first anniversary, some people will be awarded for their work today. I want to congratulate all of them. Please keep up the good work. I also wish to congratulate the Alliance Executive Council for working together so smoothly in 2020. And I wish you 
the best in your second year in office. Uh, lastly, I allow me to repeat this. Africa can do it. Let us not undervalue or doubt ourselves. Let us not undermine our capacity to innovate and lead. United will make our communities better for all, including people with epilepsy and their families. I thank you.